I'm Jesse Pridemore with Red Carpet Report here at the 67th Emmy Awards Design Nominee Reception and the launch of the 9th Annual FIDM Museum and Galleries for the Outstanding Art of Television Costume Design Exhibition. Standing here with Salvador Perez, costume designer for the Mindy Project and president of the Costumers Guild. Yes, how are you? <laughs> oh, sorry, how are you? I'm great. <laughs> awesome. Uh, congratulations, by the way. Thank you. We're very proud. Uh, how many times have you been nominated so far? This is my first. <gasps> this is your first? That's awesome. It was, uh, you know, you we, they just this year divided up the categories. Because before we were all lumped into one big category of costume design. And you can't compare contemporary costume design to period and fantasy. They're different mediums. You really should divide them all three because it really is a different art form. And so we're here because the category was opened up. That's amazing, though. And I mean, the costumes are beautiful. Uh, do you guys make them from scratch? Or? I make about 20 to 30 percent of the clothes, just because, you know, Mindy has a very particular aesthetic and we couldn't find it. We we're constantly looking for the perfect printed blouse to go with the perfect plaid skirt or the proportions weren't right. And so now we just started making it because it was so much easier. Or, you know, we take, a, a, you know, an Oscar de la Rena suit that was several thousand dollars and I completely recut it and use leftover fabric to make a bag. Well, at a certain point, it's more cost effective to just make it from scratch. That's very true. Yeah. Uh, what, uh, did you choose the, the items that are here on display today? Um, it's so hard. Everybody's like, what's your favorite? I'm like, I have so many favorites. They're all my favorites. Um, but I sort of loved the fact that this was a little combination of custom and recut. And then, you know, Danny and his um, uh, av aviator jacket, you know, it was just, it was such a classic co costume for him. That's awesome. So, um, aside from designing and obviously picking up the fabrics and everything like that, do you ever hands-on like sew them? Or um, My background before I was a designer was a stitcher. I started as a stitcher and went from stitcher to workroom supervisor to assistant designer. So now I don't have the time, but my communication with my team is so much easier. And most of the cutter fitters that work with me say it's so much easier to work for you because you can literally I design around. Like if we have a, a week to make a dress, I design a dress you can make in a week. If I have four weeks to make a dress, I design a dress that takes four weeks to make. And and it's, so it's about timing, because we're the show's huge. I mean, we, Mindy can change 24 times in one episode. And mind you, we're a 30-minute show with eight minutes of commercial, so that's really only 22 minutes of camera time, and we can change her 24 times. That's amazing. Do you guys ever reuse outfits? Um, I reuse pieces. We have never reused an outfit, and Mindy would be caught dead at something. She's like, didn't I wear that jacket? I'm like, you wore it once three months ago. <laughs> That's great, though, and it's great that you, you, you understand how long things take to make and, and the structure and all that, because uh, most costume designers, they don't sew, they just design. I mean, the thing is, I th it's my background, I'm, my background came from stitching, so I really, I bring that to my craft, and I, and I, and I love it. It's if I can't find the perfect white blouse with the right collar, I make it. How does it feel to have your work on display on mannequins? It's, I'm still walking on cloud nine. It's, it was, it's sort of surreal. Like at the first day it was very, it was, everybody was exciting and champagne was flowing. And the next day I was like, oh my God, I'm an Emmy nominee. <laughs> well, that's awesome. Good luck and congratulations. Thank you very much. Fingers crossed. Thank you so much for talking with us today. Thanks for watching. If you like our video, please subscribe. We'll have several more during the season. And definitely comment on what show you think had the best costumes.